Hey guys, welcome to a spa night, and, well, I just felt like having a spa night tonight, because, well, who doesn't, and, well, this is just, like, some things that I do during a spa night, like how to get relaxed and stuff, yeah, so basically what girls do on a spa night, I guess, so let's just get into the video. God, what one should I do? I seriously don't know what one I should do. If I should do this one, which is the deep cleansing aloe vera cream mask, or facial exfoliator cherry and apricot cleanser, or the one that I use most often, which is this refreshing pomegranate peel off mask. Yeah, I'm gonna do this one. Yeah, so usually I just like put my hair up and um, little clips so that it's like not in my face when I apply. Yeah, so it looks like I'm going with this one. Yeah, you're supposed to get your face wet before applying this. And you I just apply it by using my fingers. Cut well. That's how you're supposed to apply it. And yeah, it's a peel off mask and I leave it sit for twenty minutes. And then I well peel it off. Because it's a peel off mask. What else do you expect from a peel off mask? Yeah, so um, just like, apply it all over your face, like every single part of your face, even this little thing right here, uh-huh, and, yeah, so it's like this, I will show you what it looks like when you have all of your face mask on. There, now all I have to do is let it sit for 20 minutes, and then, well, I peel it off, and it's not like the commercial where you peel off the whole thing in one try. It's like you peel it off in separate sections, and the parts that you can't get off, you take a washcloth and scrub. So, yeah. So, face mask is done. Let's get on to the next thing. You're going to want to seal up your face mask so it doesn't, like, get dry and hardened. But, yeah. It's drink time. Drink is a check because you need something to keep you awake because this spa mask will make you <sighs> really tired. Yeah, it'll make you really, really tired. And as you can see, it looks like I have a mustache. I got a mustache. I'm from Wisconsin, so cheese. Then I just like to watch TV. Yeah, and I have a flashlight because otherwise it'd be way too dark to film this video. So I got a little flashlight. <laughs> I can't get it to stay.
ten fifteen is when I take this off. And yes, it is my phone right here. Time to paint my nails while I wait. Nails are done. Time to peel off my face. Mm. See? Doesn't all peel off at once. What did I tell you? I know it looks really weird when you peel it off because it's like, oh, I'm peeling off my skin. Rawr. This looks gross. Uh, uh, uh. I'm pretty sure I have enough that I can peel off right now. Like all that I can peel off right now, basically, is off. So I'm just grab a washcloth and start like going over my face to get all of the stuff that I didn't get off off so my face is pretty much all gone and then I'm just taking off my clips and then you just pat your um, face dry with like a towel. Now you're ready for your spa day makeover, which is just a little powder and lipstick. So I'm gonna just apply some spa day makeup. Mmm. Yeah. And my cheeks, like after you um, take off your spa mask, if you use the one that I used, which BTW. I got mine um, at Target because they have a whole section full of spa masks. So I got all mine at Target. And yeah, this is just to dust off your face, like make it look, I don't know how you want it to make it look. So yeah, then just apply some baby lips clear. And then baby lips lip gloss on your lips. Yeah. And of course, have your hair messed up like mine. So that's the whole spa day look. And there's a cat rubbing against my leg. She's purring. So next you're just gonna have all the dead skin off your feet with my little homemade foot bath. What you need for my foot bath is warm water, a bowl, and some of your favorite Bath and Body Works shower gel. That's basically it. You're gonna want to fill up your bowl with warm water. Yeah, just, just warm water, that's it. Just warm water. So my bowl is filled with warm water, and I'm just gonna open my shower gel, do two squirts, one, two, and then I'm just gonna wanna get something to like mix it up so it gets that bubbly effect. So I just grabbed this cake thing, because it was the first thing I saw, and I'm just gonna mix this all together. So it's like bubbly. Okay. Yeah, it's done. It doesn't have to look extremely bubbly, just a little bit bubbly, like that. Little. It's hot. Okay, so I'm just go set this up and show you guys my foot bath, which leaves your feet smelling good. 
So then you just dip your feet in your little bath. Oh my god, it's hot. Oh, I'm gonna let that cool down for a little bit. It's really hot. But yeah, just let them sit in your foot bath for a little bit. And your feet will smell awesome. So I added some cold water and it's actually bubbly now. So, ooh, this feels so nice. You do one foot at a time, otherwise it's going to fall and get destroyed. So I shall show you. Douche. Yeah. So, it's my little foot bath. So one foot is done, so I'm just going to wipe it dry. And then let it s sit in the air so it... It's its country apple because that's the scent that I used. Little kick. So, time for the other foot. Oh, yeah, that feels so good. My other foot is about done, so I'm just going to do the same exact thing that I did to the first one. Just like oh, drying it. Yeah. And now your foot will feel really smooth and like no dead skin is going to be on it because that's my secret it also gets rid of all your dead skin and leaves your foot smooth mm. so that's it for this video hope you guys enjoyed this long spa day well spa night because it's night time and yeah Say hello to my camera. Yeah, so like this video and subscribe to my channel. Bye.